Hello everyone and welcome back to RuneScape. On today's episode we are going to do Creature of Fenkenstrain. Alright, so to do this you need the Restless Ghost, Priest in Peril, 25 Thieving, and 20 Crafting. You also need three spools of bronze wire, a needle, five thread, silver bar, and 50 coins. And you can start it in Canifus, right smack in the middle, right there. The signpost has a note pinned onto it. The note says, Brain Dead Butler Wanted. Grave digging skills essential. Hunchback advantageous. See Dr. Fenkenstrain at the castle northeast of Cannabis. Well, there sure is a castle northeast of Cannabis. I mean, is it though? It doesn't look like much of a castle. Hello? Dr. Finkenstrain. Have you come to apply for the job? Yes. Yes, if it pays well. Then I'll, ha I'll have to ask you some questions first. Okay. How would you describe yourself in one word? Brain dead. Hmm, I see. Next question. What would you say is your greatest skill? Combat match cooking, grave digging. Hmm, I see. Looks like you're just the woman for the job. Welcome aboard. Is there anything you'd like me to do for you, sir? Yes, there is. You're highly skilled at grave digging, yes? Uh, yes, that's what I said. Excellent. Now listen carefully. I need you to find some stuff for me. Stuff? That's what I said. Stuff. What kind of stuff? Well, dead stuff. Go on. I need you to get me enough dead body parts for me to stitch together a complete body, which I plan to bring to life. Right. Okay. If you insist. Gardener question. Okay. So where am I gonna go to do that? Oh, there's a fucking grave right graveyard right here. Read grave. Here lies a known rest in peace. Coffin is incredibly heavy and doesn't budge. Here lies a known rest in peace. Hmm. Do I do I need a spade? I probably need a spade. Didn't say I need a spade. Oh. Okay. Maybe I'll go talk to the gardener. Whoops. There is another door in my way. What happened to your head? You feel power emanate from the emit of ghost speak, and the air around you vibrates with the ghostly voice of the headless gardener. Oi! Oi was in an old haunted forest of the south, digging a pit for my old master, old Fenkenstrain. When would you believe it? Someone chopped me head off. Awful bad luck, weren't it? Oh yeah, dreadful bad luck. So I thinks to myself, I don't need any head to be getting on with me gardening, as long as I got me hands and me spade. Would you show me where the place was? Well, I suppose I've got ten minutes to spare. Okay, so he's following me. Alright, so where do we go from here? 
Need to head off to them haunted woods, mate. Well, that looks like a haunted woods. Go southeast. Alright, so southeast is down that way. <sighs> That's a feral vampire. That's a feral vampire. That's a feral vampire. I'm running off. Fuck! I didn't call you back. Well, 61. Oh, that's not too bad, actually. Northeast. Oh, I do like that. Probably just about here is east. Yeah, I'm like right on the east. Okay. Oh. Okay, so we're still going. What did I see? Oh my god! Northwest. It must be like right in here. Oh, grave. Okay, okay, well, I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm gonna die. I found his grave. I am not okay with it. So I'm just gonna chill here for a second. I'm going for it! I think Edless Wit has left me. But that's okay. Oh my gosh! Nobody said you could do that! Got the head. I'm going. Going all the way back to Canopus. Okay. Uh... So I still need a torso. Where can I get a uh, and a arms and legs, of course. Okay. Okay, I had to look it up. Because I, I don't fucking know. I'm gonna take the pickled brain. If you're interested in our specialty, I see. Would you like to buy some? What exactly is in the jar? Pickled brain, my friend. Only 50 gold to you. Uh, pickled brain from what animal? Animal? Don't be disgusting, man. No, this is a human brain. Only the best for my customers. I'll buy one. Please. Very wise choice, miss. Don't eat it all at once. Savor every morsel. That's my advice to you. Use it with the head. You squeeze the pickled brain into the decapitated head. Great. Gross. Now, 
I have no idea how I would have figured this out without the fucking guide. Holy shit, this is complicated. There's no clues to it either. I'm Asian XD has got a backstab cake. Quick, everyone stab him. If I can't reach it, I'll go around. Okay, that wasn't helpful. Okay, it said to search the bookcases. Ah! Handy maggot avoidance text me. You pull open the book of hidden lash swings from the place and the bookcase swings open, revealing a secret compartment. You find the obsidian ambulant in the secret compartment. Awesome. I still don't think this is much of a castle. The joy of grave digging. Yeah. Compartment. The marble amulet. Alright. Into a six pointed amulet. Alright, so I got the star amulet. And now I need to go back and use it on one of those graves. This is so convoluted. The star amulet fits exactly in the de depression the coffin lid. Excellent. Yeah, I never would have figured that out on my own. And this will be the level 35 experiment I need to kill. Cavern key and bones. Luckily, they're not hostile. Oh, that's horrifying. Use the cavern key. Sorry, Squishy, I'll come back for you. chest. Oh, that'll be another coward key. Don't want it. Aha. Here rise Rolamir, 14th Lord of the North Coast. And I got his torso. Great. Here rise Rolla Vane, 13th Lord of the North Coast.
And I got his arms. Here I roll a gray, 12th Lord of the North Coast. And I bet I'll get his legs. And I got a pair of legs. Great. Yeah, I'll just teleport back. Alright, so I guess we're back to the good doctor. See what he has to say about all of this. This is not what good Christians do. Uh, I have some body parts for you. Great, you brought me some arms. Excellent, you brought me some legs. Splendid, you brought me a torso. Fantastic, you brought me a head. Superb! Those are all the parts I need now to sew them together. Oh, bother, I haven't got a needle or thread. Go get me a needle, and I'll need five lots of thread. Where are my needle and thread, Questy Rail? Ah, uh, a needle, wonderful. Some thread, excellent. Oh, dear. Beck and Strain uses the needle and thread to sew the body parts together. Soon a hideous creature lies inanimate on the ritual table. Perfect, but I'll need one more thing from you. Flesh and bones by themselves do not make life. Really? I have honed to perfection an ancient ritual that will give life to this creature, but for this I must harness the very power of nature. And what power is this? The power of lightning. Sorry, can't make lightning. You got the wrong woman. Silence your insolent tongue! The storm that brews overhead will create the lightning. What I need you to do is to repair the lightning conduit conductor on the balcony above. Repair the lightning conductor, right. Can I have a break soon? By law, I'm entitled to 15 minutes every... Repair the conductor and be gone! I mean... Not wrong. I am entitled to a 15 minute break for every 4 hours worked. Or a 30 minute break for every 8 hours worked. It depends on what job you're in. Alright, it's gonna be over the creature, isn't he? It's gonna be up there. Shit. Oh, maybe it is up there. Yeah, that'll be it. Yeah, I do. What do I need? What do I need? Okay, the guide says I need to talk to the gardener again. This is silly. Go to Camelot. Tis a silly place. Uh, do you know where a conductor mold is? A conductor mold, you say? Let me see. There used to be a bloke gear, sort of a Andy man. He was did everything around the place, fixed what was broke, swept the chimneys and the like. You would have had a mold, I imagine. Where is he now? He's dead, like everyone else around here, except for me. Do you know where the key of the shed is? Got it right here in my pocket. Here you go. Headless gardener hands you a rusty key. Okay. Smoke garden brush in the cupboard. Take from pile of canes. Oh, okay. This 
quest is not very clear. Not at all. Repair the lightning conductor. Damn it. Okay, I never would have figured that out either. Never in a million years would I have figured that out. I need to take three garden canes from that cane pile. I need to use a garden cane on the garden brush. Yep, there we go. And... Okay, and now I need to go to the chimney. Place. Go up. You give the chimney a jolly good clean out. Okay. That wasn't the right fireplace. Okay, I gave the chimney a jolly good clean out. Are there more fireplaces? Probably upstairs there are. Yeah, okay, so I've exhausted all the fireplaces except for one. lightning conductor mold falls down the chimney. Why the hell did you hide it there? I don't know. Let's go to Lumbridge. Come on, Squishy. Take us to Lumbridge. You're such a good Squishy. Come on. Let's go. There we go. Conductor. Alright, then I'll never need that again, so you can drop it. Now, back to Canopus. I probably won't ever need this extended brush again either, so I can drop that too. Alright, off to com to off to repair the conductor for the third time. Open that door. Go up the ladder, repair the conductor. You repair the lightning conductor not one moment too soon, and a tremendous bolt of lightning melts the new lightning conductor, and power blazes through the castle, if only briefly. Melts it. Well, I hope this worked, because I ain't doing that again. So did it work then? Yes, I'm afraid it did quest derail all too well. I can't see it anywhere. I tricked it into going up the tower and there it remains imprisoned. So the creature wasn't all you'd hoped then? Oh, what have I done? 
Oh, I see. We're developing a sense of right and wrong now, are we? A bit late for that, I'd say. I have no control over it. It's coming to get me. So what do you want me to do about it? Destroy it! Take the key to the tower and take back the life I never should have granted. I mean, it's a bit late for that. You never should have given it life in the first place. Just saying. Looking good, okay. Oh! He was under me. I am commanded to destroy you, creature. Oh, that's not very nice. Are you feeling okay? Absolutely. Never better. You don't look very dangerous. How do I look? You really don't know, do you? Have a look for yourself. The creature stumbles over toward the mirror, focuses upon his reflection, and... Ah! The creature instantly becomes sober, horror all too evident in his undead eyes. I'm sorry. I suppose I'm partly to blame for this. No. It was him, I wager. Fenkenstrain, wasn't it? He's brought me back to life. Who are... were you? I was Rolagar, Lord of the North Coast. This castle was once mine. Fenkenstrain was the castle doctor. So the castle wasn't really abandoned when he found it? Is that what he told you? No, no, this castle was once full of people and life. Fenkenstrain advised me to sell them to the vampires, which I am sad to say I did. I found your brain in a jar in cannabis, so he must have sold you too. Of that I will not speak. There lies memories that should rest with the dead, the living unable to bear them. That's it. I'm leaving this dreadful place, whether I get paid or not. Is there anything I can do for you before I leave? Only one. Please stop Fenkenstrain from carrying on his experiments once and for all, so that no other poor soul has to endure suffering such as that of my people and I. Okay. So have you destroyed it? Never, now that he has told me the truth. Oh my, oh my, that's exactly what I feared. Why did you have to pick Roligar's brain of all brains? I'm through working for you. No, I refuse to release you. You must help me build another creature to destroy this dreadful mistake. Wait, pickpocket? No, oh, uh... Pickpocket him? Okay, great. Ring of Charis, a thousand thieving XP, and two treasure hunter keys. Yay, and I leveled up. Yeah, level 42 thieving is one of the requirements for Temple of Ikov. And I can steal from fish stalls. Hey, Lord Rologarth. How goes it, friend? I stole the Ring of Chars from Finkenstrain. I saw him climb up the tower to hide. It doesn't matter. Soon the werewolves will come for him, and his experiments will be forever ceased. Do you want the ring back? It's yours, after all. No, you keep it, my friend. Werewolves hunger for the scent of live flesh. I have no need for the ring. I have my castle back, if not my soul. Thank you. Alright, well, that is all the time I have for today, so thank you everybody so much for watching. I have been Rael, and I will see you next time.